Baywatch, positive for the lifeguarding community? <laughs> Honestly, that's a great question in the way that it was phrased, because it was like, you know, how, how close is Baywatch to lifeguarding? But no, it's like, what has Baywatch done for the lifeguarding community? A little bit of both. I think in the 80s, when all when that stuff was really as popular, like early 90s, I mean, we forget, by the way, Baywatch was the most popular show in the world. World. Was, in the entire world, Baywatch was number one. And, Hasselhoff had himself a hit uh, album in Germany. So just respect. Because as serious as it is, and it's super serious, it's also, you know, I mean, you're a bunch of athletic knuckleheads who are passing the time on the beach in between having to run in the water. So it gets goofy. But the answer to the bathroom thing is you just go wherever you are, right? No, there we have technique. There's techniques. We, we, you, If you ever see a lifeguard sitting uh, at the bottom of the chair with a towel wrapped around them, it's it's an 80 percent chance they're going pee i've had full conversations with people while going pee uh, you know because you just sit there you dig the hole you wrap the towel over you you sit on the buoy and it just looks like you're chilling in front of the chair when really you're just peeing right right mm. out there amazing so bottom line is you're telling us that david hasselhoff and pamela anderson have both pooped in the ocean at some point <laughs> 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 You're going to get him on camera saying that. Dave Parker would never. <laughs>